Off beat. Stories that are not necessarily the news. Okay, time to take a look at some things that are not necessarily the news. All right, you got some or you want me to go? You can go. I can go. All right. (laughs) Thanks, man. Very polite of you. (laughs) All right, so did you know, Chris, that, uh, you know, Brazil is made up of a lot of different ethnicities and groups and so on. Did you know, though, that there are more Lebanese living in Brazil than they are living in Lebanon? What? Yes. It's impossible. Yeah, no, no, it's oh. very, very possible. Just go to Brazil and check it out, man. You know? Oh. Carry one of them things there, counters, you know, like, click, 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 every time you see that. <laughs> All right. Um, you ever heard of a guy called Jacqueline H. Lucas? I haven't, so no. don't be ashamed to say you didn't. I don't know. Yeah, okay. Apparently, three years after joining the Marines at the age of 14, what are his parents were? Anyhow, my man snuck onto a ship for Iwo Jima, right? Stormed the beach without a rifle and threw himself on top of two grenades to protect his team. This guy won't die, right? Anyhow, he managed to survive and he earned the Medal of Honor at the age of 17. Goodness gracious. My goodness. Boy, a crazy guy, huh? Wow. Yeah, yeah. Imagine throwing yourself on two grenades. No, I can't. No, 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 I can't either. (laughs) Srivijaya was a lost 14th century city that ruled Indonesia and much of Southeast Asia for over 600 years, but disappeared without a trace. Its location was recently uncovered when fishermen at the River Musi discovered golden artifacts from the city caught in their nets. Yeah, what a catch. Uh, it's a floating city, yeah, you know? Right. All right. Um, you know how New York, New Jersey got its name? I didn't. Mm, no. All right. So apparently it was founded in 1666 by disgruntled Puritans from Connecticut. They wanted to start a theocracy, so they named their settlement New Ark, N-E-W-A-R-K, right? Believing they were creating a new Ark of the Covenant. Mm. See? Yeah. So New Ark remained a Puritan theocracy until 1746 when Episcopalian missionaries built a church. So New Ark morphed into New York. It's an American way of saying New York. Yeah, not New York. (laughs) Yeah, where are you from? I'm from New Ark. (laughs) That's like saying in Trinidad, I'm from San Juan. You know, they say, oh, you come from Puerto Rico? (laughs) No, 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 no. I, I, I come from Sawa. Huh? If you're in Trinidad, it's Sawa. Right, 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 Telly? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. So, have you ever heard of isopropyl acetate? Yes. Yeah, what is it? No idea. <laughs> I've heard of it. You said that confidently. <laughs> oh, well, well, clearly, you know, isopropyl acetate. <laughs> what, else, what else could it be but a chemical? <laughs> It's not, smart, right? it's not a plant-based food, you know what I mean? Um, it's apparently called, I didn't know about it either, so don't feel me, there's two of us, two dummies in here this morning. It's the alarm chemical, huh? and it's apparently released by bees to make the hive attack, all right? So if the, the, the hive needs to attack, this is what they release, the alarm chemical, wow. isopropyl acetate. And apparently, get this though, Chris, this is the interesting part. It's the same flavoring we use to make banana flavored sweets, meaning bees can become hostile around those sweets. So, yeah, just be careful. Watch, watch yourself with the bananas <laughs> and the bees, boy. Have you ever been stung by a bee? If? Really? <laughs> Listen. <laughs> and that thing, that thing really hurts, man. You know what I mean? So, yeah, so apparently uh, around banana flavored sweets, bees can become hostile. You know, uh, I heard of the bee, the birds and the bees, but I never heard about the bees and the bananas. <laughs> <laughs> but there you have it, the alarm chemical, isopropyl acetate. Uh, yeah, which the bees give off, man, the alarm chemical. There you have it, some stuff, man, Chris, that, well, it's we not, didn't know it. Yeah. But it's stuff that is not. Necessarily the news. Brought to you by Nature's <laughs> Discount. Get healthy.